I didn't know anything about archery before I got to Hawking College. It kind of gave me a goal, and I need a goal in life. I just really need something to push me. I need a target. We live in a part of the country where uh, bow hunting and uh, the, the search for the food for families is, uh, is, is big. So a lot of these students that come here are bow hunters naturally. In 2014, I was skating, my last competition. I was falling on every jump. Everybody was cheering for me. Everybody knew I was in pain. My mom took me to the orthopedics afterwards and they said that I had tendonitis and if I didn't stop skating, I would lose both my kneecaps. I was always the smallest one in my class. I didn't reach actually 90 pounds until seventh grade year. I was always bullied. After my downfall in figure skating, I went into a major depression. And when you start thinking that way, you really don't think there's anything in your life that is important anymore. So my grandpa decided Maybe I could spend more time with him and try him out at the archery range, and I did. And I loved it. I fell in love with it. It became a passion. We bought a farm, and the chickens were, they were like my kids. So when something went after my kids for the first time, I was mad. So when I got that bow, no raccoon's going to mess with my chickens again, no. At the beginning of last year when archery was just started as a team, and uh, started out, actually started out with about 60 kids coming to open shoots and just, and just shooting the, their own bows that they had. And uh, from that, he started asking students uh, if any of them wanted to join the team. This ain't a team, this is, this is a family. I grew really close with everybody here. I mean, they're all, they've all helped me. I love these guys. It gives them a social outlet uh, for them that they can hang around with uh, students with the same interest. I am the 14th female archer in the country right now. Actually, I got my eye on this six points out in my hunting spot right now, and he's about the biggest one I've ever seen, so I'm planning on getting him this year. 